On the Health Watch this morning, cases of a mystery hepatitis virus in kids continue to rise here in the U.S. and really around the world. Fox News medical team's Dina Senefani is joining us this morning with more on what parents need to know about this. Good to see you, Dina. How are you? Good morning, Amy. Good. Uh, boy, this is another scary thing to put on our list of what to worry about as parents. So let me give you the latest on this. The CDC says parents need to be on the lookout as it investigates this rare outbreak among kids, kids that are otherwise pretty healthy. So, so far there's been 109 hepatitis cases that infected children under 10 years old in the U.S. 90% of those children had to be hospitalized. Five children died. Hepatitis is an inflammation of the litter, liver. It's most commonly caused by viruses. The World Health Organization says they're investigating, thinking it might be linked to adenovirus infection. Take a listen. One of the theories is that, you know, with COVID happening and people masking and children masking, you know, younger children weren't exposed to some of the strains of the adenovirus. And perhaps, you know, they're having a harder time now that they're getting exposed to it. Yeah, maybe kids, it's possible that kids did not build up immunity to this virus during pandemic, during the isolation. Uh, here's what parents need to know to protect the kids. Know the symptoms of liver inflammation. So I'm going to give you some specific symptoms. Here we go. Fever, fatigue, loss of appetite, nausea, dark urine and light colored stools, joint pain, jaundice, which is yellowing of the skin. So if you see any of those symptoms in your kids, you do want to get in for a blood test. They can check for elevated liver enzymes and then go to work. But uh, until they can figure out exactly what's causing this, parents need to be on the lookout. Yeah, it is frightening, especially reading these stories about kids who are perfectly healthy and then, you know, end up getting this. So always good to talk to you, Dina. Thanks so much. Great info for the parents.